Hey, how's it going? So, I'm going to be playing a game called Chrono Blade. I've been playing it a lot lately. It's in closed beta. Um, but what I've done is taken my PS3 controller and setting it up in the same way that John Ross did in his video. His will be linked in the details. I'll make sure of it. Um, but I wanted to take a step further and put the whole thing on my big TV because it's kind of fun to look at um, as opposed to just a computer screen. And I am I look pretty silly playing with the controller because I'm not used to it. I'm pretty used to the keyboard. Um, so this is what it's going to look like. You've already, if you've seen John Ross's video, then you don't need to see how well I set it up. He shows you just fine. So. All right, so I'm standing next to my TV to give you an idea how big it is. It's a decent size. It's not huge, depending on your frame of reference, but this this way you can see that it it actually looks pretty sweet. Um, I have a mouse hooked up to the laptop, which is connected through HDMI. That's pretty much how I did it. It's pretty simple. Uh, the mouse is just have to use some of the menus with the mouse. But I'm going to show you right now. So I'm going to play a tournament. Um, and skills like that Seismic Slam and Permafrost, because right now they're pretty sweet. And some of these other passives. Um, by the way, this is me. I am top score. I got top score this morning, so I got bored, and that's why I did this. So I'm going to go and play. I'm going to load in. Shouldn't take too long. I think this is the first time I've done the tournament level on this computer, so it might take a little longer than normal. Sometimes the music cuts out. To fix this, I don't, I don't have a keyboard in front of me letting that up down on the ground. So to fix this, you just hit escape. And then you hit enter to start the game. Oh, the music's back anyway. So never mind. But sometimes it will cut out, and you just hit escape and close. The, it won't close the game. Just minimize it back to normal screen. Then hit enter to bring it back full screen, and the music should kick back in. And look at the mouse out of the way. That's annoying. So here we go. Tournament mode. First time with controller in tournament mode. Um, I am not very good with the controller. Much better with the keyboard. That's what I've been playing with. Unless however long the beta's been going. This first part's pretty easy. I'll only give it two at a time. Like that guy pretty much falls over. I didn't even touch him. Um, I'm level 15, so I'm also... We'll go ahead and use permafrost, give you an idea what that is. Basically everything is frozen. This guy's gonna hurt me. I can't avoid that. Um, well, mostly because I was distracted talking. These guys are pretty sweet. They block, so they're actually kind of annoying sometimes. You gotta. They're not blocking right now. Later on, they start blocking. And for now, we're just gonna kill. You know, that's a health pack. You can use the, it. it um, one spawns after every boss, except for wave 20. One doesn't spawn. But one spawns after wave 21, because there's two bosses in a row. I might be giving too much information. So this is going to be boss. This guy's huge. I'm going to avoid him swinging. He's pretty weak right now. So I said I'm pretty strong. But earlier on, it really, you're missing out. So these red things actually hurt people. You see that because they're spawning right on it. Just launches them. If you kill someone on that, you actually get an extra 150 points. It'll say 250, but a kill is already 100, 100 points, so. Right now, it's really not too bad. These bugs are annoying as crap, because they will attack you quickly. Oh, ouch. They'll attack you quickly, even after you attack them and break your combo, and there's pretty much no avoiding it. And I can see... He also gets stuck in combos sometimes, which is what happened there, and I couldn't avoid the exploding bug. And the exploding bugs are kind of neat because they'll actually hurt other people. Oh, not used to where the block is on that. See, now they're starting to block. Can't take damage. 
Well, I'm taking damage because I crit them, and I have a, uh, a talent, skill, talent, whatever you want to call it, pa a passive that anytime I crit someone, uh, they'll take periodic damage after. It, that's useful because um, it'll help continue combos. Anything with dots are good. Like, this has dots if someone are in it. Ouch. It's, it's not good when you get hit, though. But see, I, I'm getting combo hits, even though I'm not actually punching things. Alright, so this guy's a little bit stronger. For the most part. No, I'm not used to the jump is. Oh, I don't have jump in this. I need to fix that. I do not have jump in my controller. So, I'm gonna probably... I'll grab that, since one spawns after. Now there are there is a, a combo where he jumps, which is this. That's a light attack, light attack, strong attack. But I don't. Yeah, I'm used to having jump. Whoops. Now I don't know what I need to fix. Oh. The nice thing about this is it pretty much just freeze, freezes everyone. Um. Ouch. Uh, these, that's the thing about blocking is they will uh, find, they'll find decent times to hit you and you can't hit them back. Uh, ouch. See, I, sometimes you just get stuck and you can't back out. That just happens. But that, I mean, that is also just knowing when to get your, let yourself get into a combo. I'm not using black because I'm just not using the controller as much. I, I actually do block more on a keyboard because it's right there. See, how he does that little quick swing thing. Like you, pretty much nothing you can do. You can't anticipate it because there's no animation prior to it. Or it's a lot of these will have prior animations. Oh, he's gonna hit me. I'm gonna go and get the health back because I'll just freeze everything. He's not too bad. So when they start getting red, it means they're gonna start resisting your attack soon. Which means it gets really annoying. I think he was going to flip over quite yet. Oh. Maybe he used to block it more. Ow. It's not too... Too exciting yet. When it starts getting crazier, see now they're starting to resist, which means they don't like you don't CC them. They don't knock back or anything. So you have to do a lot of diving around, which I'm not used to in the controller because it's a lot of D-pad presses. I'm not really sure how the thumbstick will work very well because you have to double tap a lot. Ooh, I got purple shoulders. And that's probably pretty awkward with a, with a dual shot or a thumbstick. Yeah, thumbstick. That's what I'm oh. I'm just blow everything up here. Oh, oh, no. And you can't block those. Since I was in a combo, I couldn't dodge out of the way. Like, you're going to anticipate him because he raises his hand in the air, but if you're already doing like that. Oh, well. I just killed him. Oh, that was a decent crit. Let's see. Oh, I can't move. Should probably get the health pack. However, I'm past 15, so there will not be a health pack after the next boss, so I have to be careful. The nice thing, though, about blocking is strong attacks will go through the blocks. 
Um, so... Ow. Oh, these guys. Yeah, these guys are pretty much resisting everything. And... This is the other ability. You basically launch a giant. And it lowers their armor and stuff. I don't really use... I mean, I'm pretty basic with my abilities because I, I'm more interested in getting my combo up. And that's what... Um, permafrost thing is really good for. Because the... The fist punch thing doesn't actually place a dot, it's... I'm less inclined to use it. Oh! See, it's too slow getting the comp. I don't have jump. I would have been able to avoid that. Oh, no, okay. And I'm finally dead. That is Chrono Blade with the controller. That was my first time. Uh, you have the option to revive here. I can't. I don't have any more crystals. Pretty much used them all up. I um, used them all up a few days ago. So, timer runs out. And then we can see what my score is. It's gonna not going to be anywhere near my top. Not too bad for my first time. So, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the, seeing the run through and just what uh, this game's capable of. Even with the controller, it's it's still pretty smooth. Um, and, and the only reason I might have slipped up is because I forgot to include things like a jump. And uh, because I'm just not used to the controls as very well. So, I hope you guys enjoy the video. And yeah.